But what I did today was I had about 25 little small potatoes. I usually have bigger ones. And then I kind of overdid it with eggs. I did 11. I don't usually do quite that many, but I always eat one while I'm cooking it, so I have to adjust for that. I put them on the boil, and then I stick my knife in there, and when it goes in easy, and you tell there's not anything hard, you know they're soft enough, you don't want to overboil them, but you don't want to uh, not boil them long enough either. But once that knife goes in there like that, just soft, you know they're done. So you take them out, you pour the water off. I put pour some cold water on them just to cool them down so I can take the skins off and get ready. And the, the boiled eggs, I'm assuming most people know how to boil an egg. The way I do it is I put them in the water and I add some salt and then I boil them at least 10, 10 minutes. Okay, now the next process, what I'll do after everything's been put uh, peeled, what you want to do, what we do at Duck Commander, we cut our potatoes up. We don't cream them, we don't mash them, we cut them up into chunks. And I'll show you what I'm doing. I do them about this big to where, see they're like this. And I like the potato salad still to be warm. It's really better. You cut the chunks up, all the potatoes. Some of them will start falling apart before you get to them. This will feed quite a few people, so you'll want to have company if you do this much. You just chop your eggs like this, and you kind of have to mash into it so that that yolk will go on in when you mash. I feel these is really big. Actually, a little bit bigger than I do. Okay, next we're going to add the seasoning, which would be salt. And I haven't measured this. I need to do it. But right now, I'm just going to show you what I'm doing. I will measure this. That's a, plenty of salt. And the next would be my black pepper, which I just put that generously on here. Sometimes you may have to add, have to have a taster. And then, of course, I will have to have a bite of this egg. That's delicious. I use dill relish and I use sweet relish. Usually, um, this is about two and a half tablespoons. And um, I think I got a little too much. Let me, I'm gonna look at it and see. Got about a half left in there. And this is about three. I don't know. Let me see. One, two, yep. This is about three of the sweet relish. Next, we just want a squirt of mustard. That's it. About this much. The next one is the hardest one to judge, and I do have to work on measuring this. You want this everything wet, but not over wet. We're going to put in the mayonnaise, I call it mayo, but this is, that'll be eight tablespoons of mayonnaise. And I do like it better than Miracle Whip, but that's just my preference. We'll start stirring, see what we got here. And you have to be prepared, that's what my grandmother always said, we always be prepared to feed the strangers. Now I need my trusty assistant to come in here and taste this. I think it looks short of... Um, I'll be your assistant, honey, any time. I've been eating this for 45 to 50 years. It's perfect. Is it absolutely perfect? Mm -mm. That is delicious. It is. It really is. Thank you. Very good. And that's the Duck Commander potato salad.